Uh, the holiday went great. Um, we had one minor boat accident last night. The weekly use for the lake was up. Um, no major reports or problems. Uh, the boat count this year was spread out over a week instead of all congested over a weekend or one weekend day. Um, the fireworks shows spread themselves out and instead of having them all on one night or one or two nights, um, they spread out from the Saturday before the 4th to the Saturday after the 4th with some in between. And so really it was just one show per night uh, and that let people come out and enjoy the lake more during the week and on individual days rather than crowding it in all in one day. No major issues. I'm not aware of any arrests made on the lakes this year, which is good. Uh, there was a few made at the river, but it was actually down from what we had last year. Um, like I said, the one minor boat accident that we had last night, uh, other than that, a few medical calls here and there that are mostly heat related. An estimated 7,000 took advantage of the July 4th holiday to float the Illinois River. During the day, public access, swimming, and picnic areas were full, as were most parking areas along the river bank. Even with the large crowds taking advantage of the hottest 4th of July in six years, there were very few incidents during the week. However, GRDA police reported a drowning occurred over the weekend. According to GRDA Police Captain Bill James, officers were out in full force to promote safe outings and provide assistance. GRDA continues to stress the importance of wearing a life jacket anytime on the water.